So as we're telling the story of each city and of the region, we started out with our first city. And that city was all about just getting established and making money so that we could take that money and start other cities with our ultimate goal of not only getting all of our city plots filled in, but taking on the challenge of a desert region and a city plot that's got lots of pollution and radiation. And so the story of the second city was what we wanted to do was we wanted to move on to a city get started with the academy and start doing some research and what i said was what i want to do is i want to do this research and i want to take on different challenges in steps and in phases and the purpose for choosing this particular city plot for the second city was a really cool next step would be to research the ground scrubber and before we take on the large city plot pollution of of the city and the crater this one let's take on the smaller challenge of ground pollution that's hindering all of the water underground here And you say, wait a minute. <laughs> Wasn't there ground pollution there? Yes, there, <laughs> there was ground pollution here. I knew that I knew that the the time was limited, that we didn't have a lot of time. That if you've got ground pollution, but you're not continuously adding to that ground pollution, you know, for example, underneath a if you've got a factory that's constantly putting out ground pollution if you don't have that in place it will slowly start to go away through time rain we've got a sewage treatment plant you can even put down trees um, you can put down parks to some degree or another each one of those steps will slowly get rid of the ground pollution so <laughs> we've got no ground pollution here left that's perfectly fine, but yeah, I knew that my time was limited. I just thought I would have more time, but oh well, we still need to do research, but I just, it just made me, made me smile. So good, good late afternoon, a good early afternoon. It's a little bit after one. Welcome back. We've got some things that we need to do. We've got an upgrade to City Hall. We got to do some research. Uh, but look, our city has rebounded nicely from our meteor strike. But yeah, wonderful. Wonderful. A couple of things. Thank you so much for the feedback. Number one. I agree with, and it's been almost unanimous, do not do suspension bridge. And, and I agree with that. Let's not, I think this looks better in this particular situation, in this particular city. I think the suspension bridge would not look as good as, as what this, how this looks. Got some really excellent feedback. Hey, do not do a specialization in this city. But why don't you do some some recycling? That's what we're going to do. We're, we're going to do some recycling. And we're not going to do um, uh, specialization. And then it's another unanimous set of feedback. The mayor's house. Everyone that has commented on the mayor's house says put the mayor out here at the beach someplace which works just fine considering that this area I was leaving bare because we were going to be doing ground scrubber and maybe some other technological things 
Doesn't mean we can't do ground scrubber, and we are going to need ground scrubber. For sure, we're going to definitely need ground scrubber there and maybe there are some other areas that we can that we can work on it but yeah i just i just found it funny that as i was getting prepared to start recording because this was going to be the we were getting close to that episode where we were going to start prepping for ground scrubbing this and then when i clicked because i wanted to get an idea of exactly where the the pollution was because maybe we were going to do a little bit of a suburban neighborhood around it no pollution but so but that means why don't we work on a a little suburban low density potentially area out here where we're also going to have the mayor we'll put the mayor right on the water but yeah look City looks completely different with skyscrapers. And speaking of skyscrapers, look at this. It's random. But I like the coincidence that the simulation placed these two buildings right next to each other. There are some very subtle color differences between the two. Very subtle. Yeah, very, very nice. Very cool. Very, very cool. Let's go ahead. Let's get started with... Let's do our upgrade. And I believe, if I'm not mistaken... Let's finish up the fireworks. All right. If I'm not mistaken, I believe... Yes, this is this is it. This is the last apartment. So between city number one and city number two, we have placed all departments except for Department of Tourism. And I think we needed to put it in the back here because it would interfere. See that? If we did that, it wouldn't. But let's just do this. Nice. We are now finished for the remainder of this season. We do not have to worry about any more departments. We don't have to worry about putting down any more city halls unless we're just doing it for, for the fun of it. Let's come over here. No Academy Research Project. So now we did the wave power plant. I want to stay in that in that mindset of water power. We may not even do it, but let's let's do the wave advanced wave generator. Cool. Very cool. It makes such a huge difference. When the academy is fully staffed, look at this. We are fully staffed, low wealth, medium wealth, and especially high wealth workers. Our research is still slow overall. When, especially when, when, when you're impatient <laughs> and you want the research to, to happen quick. But I mean, we're already 12% researched with the wave generator. Uh, we'll do, and some of this research is going to take place in between episodes. So there's really no need of you having to sit through this, but I want to do the level four upgrade, which is going to get us to the ground scrubber. And I think after that, so we'll do the wave generator, level four, ground scrubber. And unless I think of something else, that's probably going to take care of the research that we need as far as the academy is concerned in the region. We may do more academies just to have them, but that should take care of the research. And, and even though the ground pollution is no longer there, 
We've got plenty of ground pollution here, so we can always still do that first phase, that kind of a test run of the ground scrubber. So let's... So that, we've still got that going for us. Okay, let's get started here. How do we want to do this? I think... I kind of think I want to mirror this oval. Let's do... I wonder if we can get, let's see, first of all, can we get some parks right in the middle? Yeah, I think that's big enough. Let's do... Let's go straight line. Actually, in let's let's do it this way. Let's put a couple of shops. do want no, actually I don't want shops
that's probably going to be too much commercial. Do the mayor. The mayor's gonna have some neighbors potentially. Or we may put some parks. Alright. Mayor's house right on the water. That's not a bad view. I don't think I want medium. Let's drop back down to low density. I think that's already low. Let's do... I'll leave that at medium. That's low. Do we need... Actually, let's do this. Let's make this medium. Let's do tree-lined medium. I wonder if we could smooth this out without messing up. See if we can make this look a little smoother. There. There are the houses. And this should all be medium. That way we can fit, look at that right there. Kind of feel like more should be, let's, let's zone some houses. Let's see how it looks once houses fill in and then we may revisit. like because I just wanted to get that to medium dense to um, the right wealth level still didn't get it to, to put one of these on either side A little bit better.
Not bad. Kind of a cute little beachside suburban area. Place for the mayor and some of the neighbors. Very good. How is our research coming? 14%. So through editing, you're not going to need to. You're not going to sit through that. I am, but not <laughs> but not you. Are we happy? What's going on? Why are they red? Either not enough shopping or not enough. No work. Not enough shopping. No work. Need more shops. Let's make this commercial. And then we may flip-flop these two. Not enough shopping. No work. See if that makes them happier. Right. Other than that, how are we doing? We're a little low with power. Water is good. Sewage is good. Garbage is good. Recycling is good. Fire. Health. Police. We need more. Uh, well, I would like to have one more community college. Maybe we should have put one. Oh. Because that's a pretty good commute. For everybody down here to get to school up there. Twenty three minute wait for bus. No rubble, no abandoned buildings. 81% making money our research costs is actually more than what we're making with recycling but at least we've got some form of income coming in population look at that our population has not only rebounded but it's gone higher than before right there is the meteor strike that's when we had the meteor strike. And look, we've gone up nicely. 
Wonderful. Whoops. How about jobs? Got jobs. Excellent. Excellent. So what's more than likely what's going to happen in between episodes? In between episodes, a decent amount of research will have taken place. I think in between episodes, not only will we get this wave generator, we'll get the I'll get the upgrade and I'll get the ground scrubber. And in that way we can we can test the ground scrubber and begin the process thinking about moving on there are things that we need to do out there I think this city has served its purpose served its purpose very well So yeah, let's let's get some research taken care of and let's test out ground scrubber. Actually, look at that. That's a nice I may not stay that way, but there's a nice empty spot. And we've got plenty of control net. Excellent. Excellent.